Hey, how's it going everybody? Welcome back to Soling the Ark. I'm Flinger Foo, and today, well today, you know what, I've been taking a look around the base. Um, we've been, you know, I've been uh, busy building, I've been busy taming stuff. Um, you know, in the off time, I said in the off time, I'd go out and I'd get a whole bunch more um, dinos. Well, I did. I went out and I got Iguanodon, another Tronodon, Terror Bird, I got... Fred, that's not supposed to be parked at Fred, why are you over here? Did something come attack? And Fred actually gave me an egg earlier. It was really cool. Um, yeah. And then, dude, what are you doing over there? How did you get there? And you gave away the big surprise, and then you're doing something weird with my pillar. Clean up the mess when you're done and move along, all right? Come on, let's uh, get get you over here. Yeah, um, I went out and I tamed this. It's only level 22, but you know it's female, and yeah. So, <laughs> yeah, that's all that really matters. It's, it's female, and it's low level. It was easy to tame. Well, easy-er. Um, it wasn't exactly easy. Oh, you're stuck on Fred. Don't worry, it happens to a lot of things. They get stuck on Fred. All right, Fred's just so stickable. All right, so um, let's get you over here out of the way. You know, I'm just going to stick you wherever it comes. Get over here. All right? All right? Just get over here. All right, come on. I had you over here for a reason. I wanted... I had you over here because I wanted you over here. Dude, how, I like that tree. What is wrong with you? And that one too. And that one. Little jerk. All right, <laughs> let's just get you somewhere... You know what? Fine. All right, you're just destroying all my trees and doing bad. You know what? Don't look at me like that. All right? Just don't just knock it off. I mean it. These are real bullets. I'm not going to shoot you. <laughs> all right. Uh, but yeah, I mean, we got a terror bird, and the terror bird turned out to be male. You know, and I thought I was taming a female for some strange reason. I thought I was taming a female. And then it's just like, it gets up, and I'm like, okay, cool, let's get back, we'll get some terror bird eggs. And then I get into the base, and I'm like, you're male. How did that happen? Yeah, and then, uh, <laughs> so, yeah, I, I, something weird's going on on Ark, that's all I can say. Um, yeah. And then I found a uh, level, she was level 10, outside the uh, base. Just chilling out. Level 10 female Carno. Not gonna say no to that. She'll keep the big, ugly, uh... Oh, nice and comfy, and, you know, everybody will have a nice day, and then, yeah. And then also we got the packies. Any egg? Dude, you got a man packy egg. All right. Dude, all right. Don't move. Thank you. All right. So we got packy eggs. We got dodo eggs. And then, let's see. We got dodo eggs and dodo poop. I don't want to pick that one up. Give me eggs. All right. Oh, we got a dillo egg. Hey, all right. Give me. Thank you. All right. We got Dillo eggs, no scorpion eggs yet. And, um, oh, scorpions are not affected by the, uh, um, Overraptor little song that they sing. Um, so the only way to increase, um, Pulmonoscorpius egg laying capability is by having a bunch of them. That's it. So I think, um, I'm going to have to go out and just go tame a whole ton of them. And then no eggs up here. And I'm gonna have to pull the other Trondon up here. No egg. And let's get over here, see if we have any trike eggs or anything like that. No beaver eggs, and then, uh, yeah. Because, you know, beavers lay eggs. But they're not the kind that you can make kibble out of. And I realize I use that joke a lot, but you know... What are you doing? <laughs> get out of my way! <laughs> I realize I just shot my stego, but still. Come on, get out of the way. Everything is in the... All of you are on passive now, all right? I cannot trust you guys to wander by yourself. What are you doing hanging out up there? Dude. I can't believe that. Get, I, I had you parked all nice and pretty like, and then you had to go and screw it up. Are you gonna move? Thanks. All right, let's get you over here, you stupid stego. All right. Get over here. Now. All right, I will get my stego back in place. But there's one thing that we really want to uh, get done today. Um, because, uh, I mean, I've been taking a look at it, and we're, we're getting really high level. And then there was that one time, you know, where I accidentally turned on uh, the solo game mode. Well, I didn't accidentally do it. I didn't realize what it was doing. But, yeah, so, hey, I turned on solo mode, so we're, we're really high level now. So, um, 
uh, what I'm going to do today is, I mean, all these guys, they're, they're not, you know, they're, they're, they're cool, but they're not pretty. And so in order to make them pretty, in order to make Foo pretty, I mean, Foo is already pretty dang cool looking, all right? I mean, come on, come on, Foo, Foo's pretty, Foo's a sharp character. All right, so yeah, we're going to uh, go out and we're going to go make the, here, let me show you. We're gonna make, oh, my fire's still going, that's right, I was cooking stuff. I was cooking meat because I ran out. We are going to make the structure cooking. We're gonna make an industrial cooker today. Now, how does industrial cooker and being pretty do anything? How do they how do they correlate? How do they go hand in hand? Well, because with the industrial cooker, you can make dyes in bulk. And when I say dyes in bulk, I mean dyes in bulk. I mean really uh, quite a bit. Um, so also we're going to make that and I think also we're going to make, where are you? Where are you? Are you here? There you are. All right, we're also gonna make a paint. Oh, I can make one of those right now. Yes, please. All right, so um, let's see, I need hide. Let's, uh, oh no, hide. The one, hide is in the one marked hide. All right, thank you. All right, yeah. And so, uh, yeah, we'll take that misc, uh, yeah, and turn that on. Bam, we've got a paint sprayer. Oh, we're gonna need more crystal, aren't we? I, I didn't realize I was gonna use up all my crystals. So yeah, we've got a paint sprayer now, and we're going to go, and we're going to, uh, structures, cooking, and this. What we need now, we've got most of the stuff. I've been grinding a whole ton of metal ingots while I was out crafting stuff, so... And now we just need a whole ton of polymer. So in we can either do polymer the hard way, which is composites, polymer. Polymer takes a ton of obsidian, and I think I might actually want to do that. Um, it's just a lot easier than running up to the uh, northern biome because I just have to go farm some mountains around here and get a whole ton of obsidian. I mean, it's going to be a lot of obsidian. It's going to be like 600 obsidian. Let me see. Uh, oh, structures, cooking... Uh, yeah, you need 300 polymer, which is 600 obsidian. That's not really a big thing. Um, so, yeah, and then, uh, let's see, uh, composites. And then to go along with that, we need cementing paste. So, cementing paste and obsidian. That's really easy to get around here, especially with all the mountains and stuff. So, I think that's what I'm going to do. Um, yeah, that's what we're going to get done. Um, let's uh, grab Super Dodo. And Super Dodo... All right, Super Dodo normally traditionally has a really cool paint job, and I think that we might want to redo that paint job because I really, really love that paint job. Yeah, if anybody hasn't ever seen that paint job, you will today. All right, so yeah, um, we're gonna... I, I thought I just saw a T-Rex pop in and out down there by that turtle. Like weird ghosting T-Rex turtles. Serious, it's like a transformer turtle. Oh, did you guys see that? Oh, I'll have to replay back the footage because it really looked like right down here there was a uh, T-Rex that was coming out of this rock right here and was coming down and was going to bite this turtle and then, the, and then all of a sudden it vanished. That's kind of odd. All right, so yeah. I'm going to get up here. Um, we're going to go farm a bunch of obsidian because there's obsidian all across the tops of these mountains. Um, the only thing is it really just takes time. I'll have to go kill a few things. And I was able to kill an Alpha Rex. I was over here earlier. Um, there was an Alpha Rex, and I probably should have recorded it, because I, I was out on my taming spree, and I was out looking for raptors up here on this hill. And I found uh, one more. It was a level 15 female, I think. Um, and there was an Alpha Rex over here, and I killed it. So I have an Alpha Rex trophy back at the base. Um, now, the Alpha Rex, it's really easy to kill on an Argent. I probably should have recorded it, just so everybody knows exactly how to do it. But the key thing is, is uh, X is your friend when it comes down to that, because X will stop you midair. So... What you do when you're fighting a t uh, an Alpha T-Rex is you get right above it. Ooh, there's a red drop down there. Hey, Mr. Red Drop, how you doing? All right, but yeah, um, how you uh, um, kill the uh, T-Rexes is you fly right above them so where they can't hit you, right above their back, like right behind their shoulder blades, and you hit X. And then you just start whacking, just like that. And they can't really do much. Um, and then it was right over here um, right down on the other side of this where there was a bunch of rocks and it ended up getting stuck, which made it super easy. Super, super easy. Alright, so yeah, um, yeah, see there's tons of obsidian up here. It might take me a few trips, I might have to go look around a few other places, but yeah. I'm gonna be up here farming some obsidian and I will see you guys in a bit because today, today we're cooking. 
All right, cooking tons of berries. And that's what you do. All right, so I will see you. Dude, you almost knocked me off the mountain. That was pretty cool. All right, Super Nuttle. Thanks, jerk. All right, so I'll see you guys in a bit. All right, so I'm almost done with this first trip up here. And there is tons and tons of obsidian up here. All right, I mean, take a look at this. Um, let's see. On just this first trip so far, I've gotten... I know I, I'm actually throwing the metal out. Uh, 276 so far, and there's still a whole bunch more down here, but I'm going to have to kill some Argents. So, yeah, I mean, look at all that obsidian. I'm not even sure Super Dodo can carry it all. I, you know, I think I might actually have to come back and uh, do another trip. We have, oh, there's even more down there. All right, yeah, hey, not a problem whatsoever. I love lots of obsidian. So, hey, yeah, we're going to just go grab a whole ton of obsidian so where we don't have to keep making a ton and a ton of trips in future episodes because, I mean, obsidian... Yeah, <laughs> all right, so yeah, um, I, I'm gonna go get that done, and I will see you guys in a bit. And we're back, all right, welcome back. All right, so yeah, um, now, uh, let's see, I've got a whole bunch of stuff loaded up in here. Um, we, I made a few trips around there, I also made up some trips up, got some more oil, uh, some more crystals, stuff like that. Um, a whole bunch of stuff that I needed to, it's actually been quite a while. Uh, <laughs> yeah, so I've just been, uh, you know, I'm a little solo journey out, you know, farming a whole bunch of materials, and I realized that I was way behind on the gathering of stuff. So, you know what, I decided that we would get that done. So, let's see, uh, we need, uh, 100 there, 100... Uh, 38. I don't think that's going to be enough. We're going to need more obsidian. And so, yeah. Let's see. More obsidian. And then... Let's see. Also, I went out and I raided a few beaver dams. Quite a few beaver, beaver dams. Oh, my gosh. Uh, if there's a beaver dam anywhere on this side of the island, it is no more. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, and so, yeah. I mean, I, I, I have a lot of fun uh, pillaging beaver dams. I think they're pretty fun. You know, I'm just going to craft up all 50 of those just because. And then while that's working, then I think I'm going to come over here. And I'm going to run some more lines over here because I don't think I'm going to be able to. Yeah, I'm going to have to work my way out there and I'm going to have to crack a hole in that. And then let's see. I don't know if I can snap. Um, I might have to run a second water line down because here, let me... Take a look. When you uh, snap the uh, uh, industrial cooker onto this, it has to be floor level. So, and I don't think that is exactly floor level. It might be. I might be able to get away with it, and I'm going to see if I can first. Um, if I can't, then, uh, yeah, then it's not going to be very good. Um, but, yeah, I think I'm going to see if I can get... A thing snapped on there. Let's see if we can... Over here. I know I have some straight pipes in here, too. Yeah, straight. And then, do I have any extra taps? Um... No. Alright, so we just need stone and wood for that. Let's see. Let's grab some uh, stone. Uh, let's grab some wood. Alright, uh, crafting. Uh, tap. Tap. Craft that sucker up. You know, let's craft up two of those. You know what? Let's craft up. Let's craft up a bunch of those just where we have them when we need them. Um, yeah. All right. So yeah. Uh, let me waddle my way over. All right, and then let's go grab Super Dodo and then work our way around the other side because Super Dodo and I we we do this a lot. Um, at least uh, we have in the uh, recent bits of the last what five six episodes uh ran you know went all the way out there and it's like i said um earlier with the uh alpha rex like this x is your friend all right let's see bam all right let's see x and then uh nine yeah Oh, that might be a bad thing. All right, let's see. Let's get another workaround. And X. Come on. All right, Super Dodo. I'm not sure what's going on here, buddy, but we're going to have to get this. All right. X. There, there we go. And All right. Now we're going to see if we can snap it on that. I'm not sure we're going to be able to. 
Um, with the new clipping thing, it shouldn't be that big of a deal. Um, and then we also have that turned on on this. But with the regular public servers, um, it might be a thing so where um, I might actually have to break one of these ceilings. Oh, and that fridge is on there. Yeah. If this was a different build, I would just break these ceilings, wall that off right there. So where we could just come up like this. Well, I wouldn't wall it off. I would actually use railings. So where it'd be an open little bit right there, and then we put the thing on there. But yeah, let's get over and let's see if we have all that stuff crafted. If not, then I'm gonna cut the camera. Yeah, we still have 170 left to make. So hey, I will see you guys in a bit because this is a lot of stuff I have to craft. And I'll just be sitting here, chilling out, talking to Foo. Yeah. All right. How you doing, Foo? All right. See you guys in a bit. All right, we're back, and now let's just jump right into this. And I, I used up all my fuel in that. So, uh, yeah, before this thing turns off, let's try to see if we can get this done. Um, cooking. Bam! Nailed that sucker. All right, now let's go see if we can place this um, down there. If not, I'm going to have to run a whole bunch more pipes. But, yeah. Hmm. All right, let's see. Uh, right there. And get that, and then let's just turn that off. Get over here. Um, <laughs> I don't even know if... Oh, that's gonna pop inside there. Oh, wow. All right. Well, you know what? I'm going to... Yeah, I'm gonna run some more pipes over this way. And then uh, I'm probably gonna try to see if I can snap it over here in the corner. Yeah. All right. I'm gonna get that done. I'll bring you guys back and I'll see you guys in a bit. I know this is... Uh... Let's see. I know. Right there. And these... And it should be good. But now we also know that we can snap it in there. Super Dotto. All right. See you guys in a bit. All right. And we're back. All right. So let's get over here. And it was, it was actually a lot easier uh, picking that down there. Let's see. Are you backwards? You're backwards, dude. No, don't be backwards. No. Let's see. Can I? Do you? No. Oh, you're going to be backwards. No, I don't want you backwards. And you'll snap there. Wow, you're snapping everywhere. I was because of the under... This is because of the stuff that I have. Are you? Yes, you are irrigated. All right. And you're in my floor. All right. So, hey, it's backwards and it's in my floor, but you know what? I'm going with it. All right, let's grab some fuel. Uh, let's see. Let's grab five of that. All right, now um, from here on out, we go and we take. Let's see, no, not there. Um, uh, here, we grab uh, some gunpowder, some spark powder, and then we come over here, and then we come out to the campfires. Let's see. Uh, yeah, that'll work. Do we, I have more around here? I, I've been burning a bunch of wood. All right. So um, then now we also have butt spud over here. So we're going to uh, come over and grab a whole bunch of berries off butt spud. All right, and let's see. Some yellow, some blue, some purple, some black, some white, um, some red. Yeah, that'll work. All right, so now we're just going to run this stuff in here, and we're going to load that sucker up. Um, now, it's easy. Um, you can either take and uh, just put all this stuff in there at once, or you can do, like, say, gunpowder plus all your berries. Just like this. Some fuel. Turn that sucker on, and just watch it make a whole ton. And then once it's done making a whole bunch from the gunpowder, then I'm going to go and I'm going to do spark powder and a whole ton of berries. And then after it's done with the spark powder, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to do uh, charcoal and a whole bunch of berries. And so that way there, we get just as much dye as we possibly can. All right. So, um, I mean, and look at how much dye this is making. I mean, it's just so, so much. And we, we've got forest coloring already. <laughs> forest. Yes. Forest coloring. Which means that uh, we're also going to have to go and... Uh, I, mean, I need more berries for that. Come on, let's get more berries. Um, but yeah, um, I'm going to have to uh, craft me up some uh, flak armor. I mean, it's about time. And I've had, uh, um, what was it, one guy ask me in the comments, why don't you make metal armor? I mean, well, it's, it's not really necessary. Um, and I just like um, making it, you know, when I can actually dye the stuff so where it looks cool and all, you know. Because in solo player, I mean, yeah, it can be necessary at certain times. But it's not really all that necessary. And I'm just going to use this up until that whole stack of gunpowder is gone. So yeah, that's that's how uh, much uh, dye we're going to be making. 
So, yeah, I'm going to be doing this, and I will see you guys in a bit because, yeah, I still have a whole bunch of spark powder and a whole bunch of charcoal to go through, and I have to go get a whole ton of berries. You guys don't want to sit me sit and watch me uh, farm up a whole ton of berries all episode, right? Right? Right. All right, I'll see you guys in a bit. All right, and we're back. All right, now take a look at all this. Look at all this paint, all this dye that we've got. We've got, oh, we've also got that. All right, but yeah, I mean, tons and tons, and, you know, I'll just throw that out. All right, we didn't need that anyway. All right, uh, we thought we needed it, but we didn't. So, oh, yeah. Uh, but, I mean, look at all this dye. There's just so much. Yeah, I didn't get enough black, and I didn't get enough mud. But you know what? We've got plenty. And so now that we've got that, um, now I think I'm going to uh, come over here. And then there's a website, all right, that you can go to for a whole bunch of different paint-themed templates and you can get templates and you can put them in your paint folder that can fit down there just barely all right let's see and you can put them in your paint folder all right and when you put them in your paint folder you can yeah i think i got that all right you can come over here and then let's see uh let's see how do we do this now load paints from this type uh, oh, hey, we have some old ones. Hey, all right. Uh, no, kibble. We're going to do kibble one. All right. Needed resources, missing resources. All right, so now... How do we do that? There we go. And all you do is just load paint. And this is with the new UI. See, it took me a little bit to get this done. See, and there we go. And that's thing for kibble. And now we uh, smack this. All right, and smack it just like that. And then now we uh, load paints from this type. We go to Kibble 2. And bam, load that paint up. All right, and here, let me show you. This is really cool. All right, it shows you the painting when you're done. So like that. Now we have just like this. So it shows you exactly what you need for that one. So then we can come down here, smack this one. And then we go load paints from this type, Kibble 3. And then, bam. Yeah, this is really cool, doing this. <laughs> I love doing this. And, uh, yeah, let's see. Uh, now and then, uh, I'm not sure if this one is set up just right. You know what? I'm going to go with it. Screw it. All right, let's uh, kibble four. Bam. All right, come on. Oh, and yeah, I don't think we have enough mud to do all this. Um, I didn't. I only crafted up a few mud. Eh, that'll work. All right, so let's uh, put one more right here. Let's, uh, you know, let's get them more centered this time. Here we go. Here we go. Bam. All right, cool. All right, let's uh, get this. It will five. Load that sucker up. And you know what? I think I'm going to go around. We're going to uh, paint up a whole bunch of paintings because I've got a bunch um, from season two still. All right. And then, uh, yeah, let's see. This is a kibble five. And this is kibble six. Yeah, I've got a bunch uh, from the uh, camera from uh, season two that I took. So, you know what? I think I think I, uh, I, I have a promise to keep. And, all right. Let me finish doing this one. All right, and what I mean by a promise to keep, you will find out here in a sec. Let's right, so load that sucker up. All right, and one last one right here. Bam. Go down to seven, or eight. Load. Yeah, this is so fun. Yeah. All right, so there. We've got, for the most part, our kibble chart right there on the wall, right next to the cooker. Yeah. All right. And then, let's see. Um, where is my fireplace? The fireplace right here. And uh, for some reason, the fireplace's textures just don't like rendering in. But... Oh, there they go. Oh, hey, they finally rendered. All right. Now, um, let's see if I can find it. Uh, load paints from this type. Is this it? Nope, that is not it. This one it? No. And the disposable camera is one that you can go around. You can take pictures... And then you can... There you are. All right. I told you, Mr. Carno. I'm going to make you a star. 
This Carno doesn't even exist anymore, but while I was taking a picture of him, he decided he was going to come over and try to eat me. So, you know what? I told him that I was going to make him a star, and he wasn't even going to realize what was going on. But you know what? It's this Carno right here. <laughs> and this is from season two. All right. Let's see. Now, what I was saying with the disposable camera is you go around, and you can take um, pictures of things around the... Uh, um, the island and then you can turn them into painting canvases and it's pretty cool. So let's uh, there we go. Mr. Carno. Oh Yeah, oh, yeah, you're gonna be immortalized. Yeah <laughs> Stupid Carno what did it eat me and then also another cool thing is that you can also load up templates from uh, it's a uh, arc paint dot com and they have a tutorial on there on how to add it into your painting uh um, folders and then also uh, arttemplates.com, I believe it is. Uh, yeah, let's see. Um, let's see. Where are you, Spitfire? Yeah, load that sucker up. All right, come on, come on, and you can see it in the background as uh, Super Dodo gets slowly painted. All right, let's see how you turned out. Oh, well, it didn't transfer completely with the new... Oh, you... oh, dude, you look amazing, dude. You look awesome. Oh, yeah, we have Super Dodo's colors finally back. And I might need to go over and touch over a little bit, yeah. Because as the models change and the textures change and stuff like that, then it, um, the same old templates won't cover a whole bunch of stuff. But, yeah, oh, man. And let's... Oh, yeah. That's awesome. <laughs> Super Dota, you're back, dude. You're back. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, buddy. Enjoy it. Love it. All right. Dude, you look absolutely fabulous. You do. Really. Absolutely fabulous. Now, I don't know what other ones I have. I know I have a bunch for uh, um, Allosaurus, but I might have to go look up a few more. But you know what? Let's uh, take and let's let let's spruce this place up a little bit. Let's get this place going like this, and then bam! And then I've got a bunch of paintings. I had one a nice one out of of a beaver that I decided that I wanted to put over here. Where's the beaver? All right, Mr. Beaver. There you go. Let's put one up of a beaver, and then once this is done, I'm going to uh, scroll down a little bit and see what other paintings I have. But yeah, I mean, come on. This, this is just really, really cool, is being able to spruce everything up. And then also, we're gonna bust out the paint gun here in a sec. The paint gun is kinda cool. All right. Now the paint gun, the paint gun allows you, instead of crafting things in bulk, it allows you to paint things in bulk, which is pretty neat. <clears throat> All right, so there's the beaver. That's over at the uh, Hidden Valley area, over the Hidden Valley Ranch, and yeah. All right, so let's uh, stick another one over here. That should be about right. Smack you. Let's load paints from type, and let's see what other ones we have. Okay, we also have the Rockwell recipe stuff. This right here is for all the, uh, um, oh, the Mind Wipe tonic and the uh, um, Freya Curry, all sorts of stuff like that. I'm going to hang that up on the wall later, but, yeah, it's, it's really um, handy to have that. Let's see. There's this one right here that I wanted. Yeah. Load that sucker up. This one right here is actually a sunset looking out at the volcano from, uh, oh, the waterfall that we used to have in season two. And uh, this season, I do plan on making a camera and going around and taking a whole bunch of new pictures, but I, I, I'm i not ready to get black pearls. And it takes black pearls to craft that sucker, and that sucker is really expensive. So, yeah. All right, let's see. How much more do we have? We're almost out of mud, aren't we? Ah, there we go. All right, yeah, see? It's looking up at the volcano and everything. Yeah, it's pretty cool. And that's the old volcano. Yeah, the old volcano. Back before it was changed. And it's still pretty cool. I like it. I like it a lot. All right, so now that we've got that, um, let's uh, punch up this sucker right here. Now, this sucker, you take and you put dyes inside this. Say, so, All right, so now that we have it like this, okay, you see the little text over on the left side? All right, when you right-click... You can press the corresponding number key, right? See right there, I just pressed two and it enabled region number two. So let's just enable all of them right here. And let's go over and let's just left click on this, right? Well, that didn't change much on that. 
But here, let's see. The entire thing right there just got painted. And then the more um, regions that you have enabled, the more it will... Yeah, look at that. That's sharp. Uh, the more paint it will use with each one. Oh, come on. No, no, uh, there we go. All right, so now um, say like if uh, we only wanted uh, region, say on one of these walls, if you only wanted regions one and three, and then the easiest way to find the region is you equip a paintbrush and you go up and you smack it. All right, and it'll tell you which regions um, are good on this one. See this right here is region one, two, and five. All right, and you can flip it around, all sorts of stuff. And then say like we wanted to uh, color this region right here. This it, number one is the outer wall, all right? And then number, let's see, number two is the wood beam on the inside. Number five is the inside part of the stone wall. Yeah. So say if we just wanted to paint the walls black, but we wanted to leave this wood bit, we would just go one and five. So let's do that here. Let's uh, let's go uh, eight, and then let's right click, and then we will enable one and five. There we go. So now every time we come up, press that, just bam. Paint all of our walls that way. All right, let's go around, let's do this. And it still keeps the inner bit painted like that. And it makes it kind of pop a little bit. It's pretty cool. Oh, we're probably going to have to get that one from the other side. There we go. Okay. Let's see, oh, and that one, and that one, and that one. And then uh, that one, and that one, oh, I get this one, and that one, <laughs> and then that one, and then that one. Yeah, I'm just going nuts with this stuff. This is so fun, though. All right, there, and uh, there. And I'm probably going to have to figure out a way to get inside of there. Can I get that? that? Can I get you? Stone wall? No? You don't want to be got? All right. Can I get that? Oh, hey, I got it! All right. Get that, 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 that. And just go around and do the entire thing. And there's a couple of them I'm gonna have to get from the outside. Let's... And I'm surprised that this paint is lasting this long. This is pretty cool. Let's, uh... There. There. <laughs> uh, there. Let's see that. What is that one? Stone and the rest. Oh, hey. I, I didn't realize that I did that like that. It wasn't intentional, but hey, you know, it still looks all right. Nice. Let's go like that. Is that everything? I think there's one missing. But let's go take a look outside and see. Oh, that looks all right. Hey, that's not too bad. That's not too shabby. There's going to be a couple walls that I missed. Let's see. And I kind of like that when you uh, paint the walls black, they actually look more slatish. I swear, they get, you know, looking really dark and deep. But uh, it looks more, it doesn't look really black. It looks like they came from uh, the Riverstone, which I kind of like that look a bit. And we're going to leave the rest of this like that. But then also now we're going to load up green because, I mean, black and green are two of the best colors ever. Combine it with silver and bam. All right, well, let's see. Um, oh, well, let's just one, two, three, four, five. Bam. All right, well, that probably didn't want to get colored. All right. Uh, can I color a smithy? No, you don't have... You can't be colored. All right. Just go around. Let's color all this. Bam, bam. You're not wanting to be colored at all. There we go. Now you're green, dude. You look better green. All right. Uh, let's see. Can we uh, color these? No. All right. All right. That's fine. That's fine. You don't want to be colored. Ah, all right. I knew I was going to color something green. All right. And so, yeah, I mean, that's just the fun with, uh... Oh, let's do the door. There we go. Green doors. Green doors. Damn. Green doors. Yes. Thank you. All right. And then I'm going to have to figure out something to paint silver. But, yeah, I mean, so, yeah. 
All right, I hope uh, the video helped you out, guys. I hope you had a lot of fun. I know I had a bunch of fun with the paint sprayer, with all the dyes, all the everything. And I just have so much fun when it comes to uh, uh, doing the paint guns and the paint sprayers and making the dyes and the industrial cooker. Because the industrial cooker is one of my favorite things in this game. It's so cool. It enables you to do so much fun stuff with the game. So, hey, if you like the video, click that like button. I really appreciate that. And until next time, this is Flinger Foo and Foo. And, uh... Yeah, my paint gun saying, hey, take it easy. Oh, and Super Dodo. Super Dodo's amazing now. He got his color back. So, hey, yeah. All right. Take it easy, everyone.